Hello, this is the Ramblings of an Indisciple Mind podcast for Monday, October 17th, 2016. Uh, It has been a Monday. It has been a busy, busy, busy day. I had one project that went live today, and I have another one that went into what we call UAT, User Acceptance Testing. And, uh, yeah, projects in parallel. I I really thought it was going to, if they were going to nail me, it was going to be much earlier on in the process. But it all kind of came to a head today. So, nothing super bad. uh, But it was just made for a busy, busy, busy day for me and and one or two of my coworkers that I was interacting with. So, I'm hoping that we're kind of over that hump and tomorrow will be a little bit better. But, yeah, it was a busy day today. Getting back to my normal format um, and talking about what's going on in the world of Penslinger. Um, I think I've got the, the website pretty well locked down. I, I've, I, I need to show it to the wife and see if she's got any editorial comments or other comments to make. Um, and, then, and then once she's happy with it, then I got a little um, conversion stuff to do. But I'm hoping... I'm kind of hoping maybe by the end of the month, I'm going to be throwing that site live. And and so what that's going to mean is that I, I've got to change some things so that when you go to penslinger.com, it's going to point to the, web, the WordPress site instead of the, uh, the Blogspot site. Um, and... Uh, what else is, is that going to entail? Uh, it's not really going to be... It's going to be pretty pretty straightforward for some people. And it's going to be a little less straightforward for others. I am going to be um, importing the entirety of the Penson blog into it. And that's what's going to cause a, a wee bit of pain for people that subscribe to the RSS feeds. Uh, because I'm going to have to change... Uh, you know, I use FeedBurner as the for the outside feeds, but I'm gonna have to change the feeds that they're based off of to instead of using the Blogspot feeds, to use WordPress feeds. Um, and so, what'll happen is if you're subscribed to one of the feeds, uh, once I make that change, everything I think is gonna show up as unread, uh, and you'll just have to go in there and say, "Yep, saw that," and and mark everything as read again. Uh, I will try to give you some heads up on when I'm gonna flip that switch. I will tell you that uh, one of the things I have on there is I have a little teaser image of the new uh, cover for uh, the first Nest Relevant book, Borrowed Time. Um, And so the other thing I need to be thinking about, uh, well, I am thinking about it, and I need to figure out how I'm going to do it, is to do some sort of a cover reveal. Um, I'm expecting that... um, I don't know. I, you know, I, I think other people have done it with like a Google Hangout or being live on YouTube. And I don't know if I should do something like that. I'm contemplating some sort of a, uh, of a giveaway, uh, maybe of the new, new and updated uh, ebook, uh, possibly based on a trivia quiz um, that, that might be done on that that live show so i don't know if you get if you're listening you got a preference if, you, if you'd be interested in that if you just want a static video or if you'd want something live that you could attend um and maybe have some goodies attached to it let me know uh i'd be interested in some input on that but i do want to do some sort of a cover reveal um soon I, I, I'm, I'm thinking that the books themselves, the, the retool books and the actual, uh, with, with the new covers and everything, probably isn't going to happen until probably after the first of the year. But I, I would like to at least get the covers announced out there soon. You know, maybe maybe like by December or whatever, maybe you know, leading into it. And uh, and so I, I'm I'm noodling how to do that. So yeah, if you got some input on that, let me know. Uh, what other things are happening in the world of Penslinger? Well, you know, NaNoWriMo is coming, and it's coming fast. And I am trying to get the re-edit of Borrowed Time done before then. I'm actually not sure that's going to happen. Um, I, I really probably just need to buckle down and get it done. Uh, 
I'm at about the halfway point right now. I was working on it some this morning. I won't be working on it tonight because we've got choir. Uh, but I probably need to put in a little time in the evenings. I have been doing some time in the evenings, but I probably just need to, to buckle down a little bit more and, and just try to get that thing cranked out um, so that uh, I, I can stick with my plan. Um, the other NaNoWriMo prep thing that's coming up is tomorrow, the 18th, is when uh, the Roundtable Podcast episode is going with with me and it is going to be is going to be uh, released at least that was the release schedule that I was that, that I was shared holy crap that sun um, yeah for those of you on video I really wanted to record it this morning uh, when I was driving in because I'm tired of this you know half of my face in in blinding sunshine and half my face in shadow BS but it was really foggy this morning, and it was dark, and it was, I thought, too dark to to record a video, and, and I've just bored all the audio people, but yeah, so that's why you're getting two-faced again today. So that's coming out. I need to sit and listen to that, or at least the bits where we're critiquing the story, obviously the, the jibber-jab at the beginning, and the actual pitch, I don't need to listen to again. Um... But I, I, I want to sit and listen to with my notes. I haven't, I haven't done. I even looked at my notes since we recorded that. So uh, I, I have noodled some things in my head that I think are going to, um, you know, I've, I've already drastically changed the viewpoint. I've changed from one viewpoint character to another. I think uh, based on what I heard there. So uh, I got other things I have to do. Uh, So I need to listen to that. I'm hoping it's going to be out so I can listen to it tomorrow morning. Otherwise, I'll be listening to it Wednesday morning and making notes. And I'll probably talk about it at some point after I've listened to it. Talk about that experience. Because I haven't, and I know I haven't. And I haven't forgotten that I haven't, but I haven't. Uh, What else is going on? There should be a review for me coming out on Nathan Lowell's Peer Reviewed soon. I've been in touch with him. And so, hey, be, 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 be um, on the lookout for that. I will certainly be tweeting that, and I'll talk about that as it comes up. Um, I thought there was one more thing. Oh, yes, I have set up my NaNoWriMo page for 2016. I've got basically the synopsis of the novel that I use for the Roundtable podcast. Uh, I didn't, I have not adjusted it for what came out the back end of that talk. Um, but I, I just threw this stuff up there. But at least I'm, I'm on the I'm on record as being a participant uh, for NaNoWriMo 2016. So, I am looking forward to that. Um, it'll be fun. It, it'll be fun. It's always fun to, to do some writing. And uh, I'm taking November 1st off, as I usually do. And um, I'm not taking much more time. Well, I've got the week of Thanksgiving off, so I'll, I'll be able to get a, a ton of writing done then. A lot of times I try to take uh, November 30th off, but I kind of ran out of vacation day, so I will not be doing that this year. And in reality, all the times I've taken it off, I've not needed it. Usually I take it off on the, on the off chance that I just really need to do a five to 7,000 word day to finish it, and that's usually not been... Uh, the case, so we'll see. We'll see what happens this year. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Um, I, I, I'm pretty confident that I'm going to get the fifty thousand. You know, if it goes, I really don't have a feel for how long this will be. I'm hoping it's going to be on the longer side. I'm hoping at least seventy thousand. But you know, if it even goes longer than that, I'll be okay if I've reached. You know, like. 50 to 70,000, but the story isn't done yet by the end of November. I'll be okay with that because I can keep going with it. Yeah, that'll in fact uh, affect other scheduling items, but uh, um, yeah, I, I will certainly do, do you know, the old college try to get it done. 
in November. That's that's definitely the plan. But you know, if I if I hit the target and exceed the target, um, but it's so it's getting to be so long that I, I haven't finished the story yet, I'm not going to beat myself up for that. I'm still going to consider it, consider it an accomplishment. But I think that's it for what's happening in the world of Penslinger. And if there's something else, I'll talk about it next week because I'm already at 10 minutes. So I will let that be that for today. I'll be back tomorrow. I'll be talking to you then. So be seeing you.